Hello and welcome to another episode of Plus 63 HP Reacts, special one shot edition. I am one of your hosts, John Clemente. Alongside with me are a couple of my bestest best friends. I'm going to start with the man that tries and tries to make us call him Zaddy or Daddy. Chewbacca. At least you said it. Does that count? <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. The omni uh, omnipotent John. So hi, this is I'm Chewbacca. You can call me Daddy. Another one of our bestest best friend right below me is the handsome man himself, RJ, aka Raymond. Hey everyone. Excited for another one shot. All right. Another one of our special, special guests, one of our friends, Isa B. Yeah, hi. <laughs> that's my name, and that's all you need to know about me. There you go. And this special episode, we are instant reacting to the trailer of The Bubble. I have no Bubble. idea what this is. It seems to be a cool thing. Trebox, you have a little bit of additional yeah. information around so, what The Bubble is. So I think they released like a quick teaser about it or and uh, some movie posters about, especially like uh, Karen Gillian, about uh, a movie called Cliff Beast 6. I've been seeing Battle, that. I've been seeing that on Twitter. Battle for Everest. Memories of a Requiem. So, Requiem. <laughs> Requiem. So, so that was a title. And the first thing I thought was like, have there been five Cliff Beast movies? I have yeah. no idea. So I thought it could have been like a life, like a history channel thing or something like mm -hmm. a, the Sharknado Or sci-fi, like a, a sci movie yeah. of some sort. Yeah. And then they finally released the real trailer. And it's like a... So the first one was like an April Fool's prank. I think the... I want. I don't want to spoil the movie, so let's just let's just hit the trailer. Let's just then, trailer, okay? Yeah, and we can react after. I yeah. like bubbles. You can <laughs> pop them. Bubbles. I don't think that bubbles. is that kind of bubble, but you can also pop pimples. So here we go, and it's got Mandalorian himself, Pedro Pascal. What? Pedro Pascal. We have Michael Peel. That Michael Peel. Like and it's on that. My ex-girlfriend Karen Gillian. Kind of. <laughs> That's not a bubble. <laughs> cool. I love that. I love that. Now that was a great take. <laughs> Welcome to the start of production of Cliff Beast 6. Oh, that's the one. Okay. But it, COVID happened. So they're in a bubble making the movie. So I would recommend oh, oh, that's, that this is so cool. Like. I love that it's so meta. <laughs> this is so exciting. It's like, Wait, that's David the Coveney. What did he say? Making sweet eyes at each other. Was I'll it? show you what that looks like. <laughs> This is so exciting. <laughs> yeah, it's like my movie posters have come to life. You will soon learn to hate these people. We are one of two movies in production right now. If we fail, the studio is going to go down. I'm not a magician. I know you're not a fucking oh, magician. Oh, shit. If you were Kate fucking McKinnon, magician, I'm in. a movie out of your ass. Oh, my God, it's Minnie Driver. Oh, I love her. <laughs> this movie's gonna make oh, Judah, but Forget about all their problems. <laughs> What we're doing is edgy. <laughs> it's real. Oh Crystal just did a fucking TikTok with a Fred dinosaur. Fred Armistead. Oh. Hey guys, I don't feel so good. Some of you tested positive for influenza. Boris. <laughs> <laughs> influenza. <laughs> Which is the good virus. <laughs> Should we be concerned about, <laughs> you know, this level of vomit? <laughs> There's some really creepy shit going down on the cliff these set right now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that skull. You look like Benedict. Yes, yeah, off his head. I don't like it. Stop it's being so Benedict close. Cumberbatch. Oh, I'm a big bag hunter with the bow. Iris Apatow. Leslie Mann, of course. Pedro Pascal. It's been a breach. I don't really even want to talk. Shit is getting real on Cliff Beasts. Oh. Or something. It's Marina. 
April 1. That's why it's April 1. I like it. Oh my so god, Netflix. this is so <laughs> fucking dope. I, I enjoyed that. It's I Netflix. Netflix. Oh, yeah. yeah. Holy yeah. shit. I'm. Oh, fuck. That was... Oh my god. All right, let's start from the right to the left. Isa, instant reactions to the oh, bubble. Oh yeah, it, it it's so crazy and like and like it's a movie that has fun with itself and no, knows how to have fun. And I I would enjoy this movie. Oh, some two bucks. <laughs> I mean, they got me at the. Some of you have tested positive for the virus. <laughs> <laughs> Influenza. Oh my god. Oh, uh, I, I mean, I mean, like yeah. Like Isa said, it's so meta, but it's so cool. It's just so funny. Jay? It's, it's the right beat. Oh, sorry. Yeah, go, go. Well, Jay. for me, it's very relatable. Especially in the Philippines, which has the longest lockdown. So definitely bubbles are something we can relate to. Um, I love the humor. The character mix is great. See? That guy even tried to drink a cup of coffee, but has a <laughs> face shield on. Case the shield. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's Not just even a face shield. Struggle. It was like a hazmat suit. Yeah, it's like a freaking hazmat suit. I know. And yes, there, see? David the company is so scared to even have any No, that contact. was Pedro Pascal. Pedro Pascal. Oh, sorry. Was that? Sorry. Pedro yes, Pascal man. handing out his plate um, to, to, to just, you know, because he's so afraid of getting sick. Because the moment you get sick, everything stops. And that's, and that's what really happened. That's what really happened. Yeah. But these this, guys this reminds are just me of that. having fun despite the shit that's happening. This reminds me of that thing with, uh, you know, did you hear about the Tom Cruise rant where he got mad on set when they were shooting? No, I didn't. COVID? What, what happened? Like, because uh, people weren't wearing masks. A year and a half or so ago. Mm-hmm. Or a year, last year. For Mission Impossible. Yeah, they were making Mission. They were, they were one of the ones that were just working through the, the height of COVID. They were still, like, they, mm. they were ones of the early ones that started making the movie. And some of the crew members weren't taking it seriously enough with like with the mask and Tom Cruise was like granted like really pissed like we're showing we're doing this for like Hollywood is watching us, you know, like if we can do this then they can if we can do this correctly with the measures that we have then uh they can continue making movies, the other studios, you know. That's right. That's it, it was right. I mean he was the producer and he had to make sure that everybody was safe. So but this one is like just so fun and Pedro Pascal like a high guy. I, I wonder. <laughs> David Duchovny is an actor too, right? He was he was in one of the scenes. Seems like Dude, yeah. yeah, he's an actor there. He's Mister X Files himself, and all the cool like that's Judd Apatow's daughter, he and then she's a very Maria Bamford is a great comedian too. Uh, but no, this seems like I think it it seems perfect. It's making fun of movies, making fun of making movies in the pandemic. It's making fun mm-hmm. of the pandemic. It has an all-star cast. It comes out April 1st, so it seems like it's like the best joke <laughs> that day. Um, and uh, again, Judd Apatow has, you know, has a good track record, not perfect track record in terms of his comedies, but he is solid. Um, and shout out to Leslie Mann, her, uh, like Judd Apatow's wife. If I'm not mistaken, mm-hmm. so he's, he's oh, really? in his, most of his movies, yeah. And I love her; she's kind of like the best. Um, but I am. This is one of those re- where where what do you call this? Um, uh, uh, viral marketing or social media marketing works, right? So um, yeah, uh, but all right, it's just so smart the the Instagram style of uh, announcing it. Is like they started with this, and then they say yeah. she, she's like, uh, "This is the best franchise I've been part of," and stuff like that. <laughs> and, then they, and then they release this after, <laughs> so it's like the same that's post, but then awesome. everything is like you know taken out. That is so the green cool. screen. Yeah, that's really fun. It's so, really yeah. cool. That's the yeah. Point. So that's it. Uh, thank you very much again for joining us in our special one shot edition of Plus Six Three HP Reacts. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Type in youtubecom Plus Six Three HP. Hit that like button. Hit that comment button. Type some stuff. Type your thoughts. Engage with us. We love commenting back. Hit that bell so you know when any of our shows drop. And as a reminder, on Tuesdays we have our review show where we deep dive on a couple of shows and a special movie every week. So you know when to watch, what to watch, and who to watch it with. 
on Wednesdays, we launch our first ever D&D campaign. Uh, it's been fun. We're a couple of middle-aged dudes uh, uh, playing our first campaign together. Uh, we're all learning together and having a blast. And on Thursdays, we have our regular reacts episode where we react to a bunch of clips, featurettes, tra trailers, and see how hyped we are about these upcoming drops for you. Don't forget, we're also in the social medias. Uh, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and we're also on Facebook. Just search plus six three HP. And if you don't like watching our faces, um, you can listen to us. Keep us on the background. Uh, we are in every single podcasting app that you think of. We prefer Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or Amazon. So again, thank you very much for every single one of our 2,000 plus subscribers. Please share us to your friends, family, and join our community of like-minded individuals who just want to enjoy content together with their friends and family. With that, final goodbyes, Trubox. Call me daddy. Bye -bye. No! <laughs> Isa? Bye. RJ? Ciao, everyone. Till the next again. I'm John. Goodbye.